Welcome. In this Blender tutorial, I will give an overview of the options we use to create a green screen, in our green screen animations. The Blender project files used in this tutorial, and other free animations are available on Gumroad for $1 each. They can be downloaded and used as you like. A link is below. When creating a green screen, or chroma key background it is important that the background is a different color to the objects in the animation. Green is the most common color, but other colors can be used. The EV render engine is used for basic animations, when photorealism or realistic reflections are not required. In the first example, the green screen background is created with a plane scaled up to overlap the camera view. The material of the green screen needs to be set up so there are no reflections of the animation onto the green screen. The metallic setting is set to zero to make it a non-metallic material. The roughness is set to one to make the material non-reflective. To light the scene, a HDRI is normally used. The background is set to transparent. This is so the background is not distracting when setting up the animation. The lighting and reflections of the HDRI can still be seen when rendered. When using an HDRI, it is important to consider the reflections of the background are not a similar color to the green screen, as this will cause issues when removing the green screen in an edit. In the next example we use the world color to create a green screen background. This is used for larger environments, such as this train track animation. We will then use the Cycles Render Engine, as this gives you more options on controlling the world reflections. Within the Ray Visibility options, the Camera option is selected. All other options are unselected. This is so the object materials are not affected by the world color. A sun lamp is used to light the scene. From the light settings the cast shadows option can be unselected if required. In the third example, the animation is rendered as a series of image files with a transparent background. We use this method the most. The image files are then collated into a movie file with a green background. When using an HDRI to light the scene, the background needs to be set to transparent. Within the output settings, the file format should be PNG. RGBA is selected, so the images have an alpha channel. The images can then be compiled together over a green image background to make a movie file. This can be done within the Blender video editor using a green screen image. Our preference is to use a separate video editor such as the Vinci Resolve. If you found this tutorial useful, click the like button and subscribe to this channel for free animations and tutorials.